Rupert Murdoch is changing his mind. He now says he will testify before the British Parliament next week. He had rebuffed lawmakers who wanted to question him and his son about the phone hacking scandal that led to the closing of the tabloid News of the World. That refusal angered top British officials. You can't hide away from this level of public anguish and, and anger and indeed interest. Murdoch's News Corp has been in crisis since it was revealed that the News of the World hacked into the telephone of a teenage murder victim and may have impeded the police investigation. Now the company's woes may extend across the Atlantic, as some in the U.S. are calling for an investigation as well. Well, I want the Department of Justice to investigate into the allegations uh, that uh, News of the World reached out for uh, private investigators in the United States with the purposes of obtaining phone information of 9-11 victims and their families and with the purpose then of getting that information and hacking uh, into their voicemails. Meanwhile, yet another former editor of the News of the World has been arrested by British police, the ninth so far. Rita Foley, The Associated Press.